I don't care. Jen is Sky Mommy. Sky Mommy. Yep. Jen is Sky Mommy. Sky Anyways, mommy. um, I can tell my kid. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how he'll feel about that. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, all right, so getting into the match, Utah running the Rotom Toga Kiss again, and Skynerd gonna be running his Mew that he ran during the winner's final set. It worked out really well for him. I don't think he got the uh, bonus crit at any point during the set. I think he just got the attack every time. I think so. No, I think he got the crit once. Did he? Yeah. I, I don't remember. But, yeah. but anyways. Yeah. Utah winning duel has Skyner about half health right now, but Skyner getting a combo started goes for the grab reset, but not quite going to get it. Ooh, load him. That's going to catch him. Put him in the corner. Who drops the combo. Oh, nice barrier. Yeah. Barrier shutting down that approach there. Yeah, and Skyner has that speed debuff still, so it's going to be really hard for him to get in. And yeah, that's yeah. going to be Utah's round. Utah looking pretty strong here. Um, I think coming off that match with Storm has helped his help bolster him a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit. Princess levels are a little funny. But anyways, yeah. All right, Utah has Skyner in the corner. Yeah, and gets the call out on the drop on the drop down there. So. Yep, just gonna back off. Um, let Skynerd burn that. Yeah. Ooh, text Ooh, to grab. Very, very nice. good. Yeah. Skynerd high enough in the air to be able to oh. actually uh, react to that tech. Sitting right there in your face, it's kind of hard to react to that. Yeah. Utah, very but solid game one. Utah, Utah very dominantly. Yeah. I feel that riding off that victory over Storm is helping a little bit. Yeah. He got his confidence boost. Um, he's got his mind in the game a little more. Yeah. And um, Skyner ooh. going back to the character select screen. Is he gonna? Is he gonna pull out the Machamp or the Charizard? I would I... expect to see the Charizard of the Machamp. No, here. I I think he might just be switching his support. Um, he's been playing a lot of Bird, and I honestly think at this point Bird's his best character. Thanks. Very well. Ooh, but we are going to see the Charizard. Pull out the Charizard. That's unexpected. Yeah, I, I guess he just wants those 50-50s. Get that big damage going. I mean, he wins neutral once, twice. That's that's yeah. uh, that's almost a wrap just right there, as it is. And Skynerd getting in. Ooh, gets the helmet attack, charges it, gets a little bit more damage. Has Utah in the corner. Oh, nice, grab. nice. Gets the seismic toss here. He's gonna yeah, 50, 50. dive bomb after. Ooh. Right into another seismic toss. The call out. And that's a perfect. Yeah, that is a perfect from Sky Nerd. Man. I guess the mix up to uh, Charizard is. Yeah, throwing him off. Yeah. And this doesn't even have to be the whole set. This can be just for a game or two to. You know, maybe get a win for himself. Change how Utah needs to be Oh my playing. goodness. I don't know why Utah went for the grab there. He was still in the air. Yeah, and now he gets another 50-50. What does he go for? Just goes reverse. Just burst. Burst. Put him in a disadvantage right. position. Utah saying, no, I'm not going to get hit with another perfect. Yeah, the Rotom not quite connecting, though, on that combo. Yeah. Goes for burst. That's he's just gonna kill that. Yeah. But he is getting the chip damage off that burst. Ooh, six health. One health. Oh, that'll yep. be it. Skyner taking a game with his Charizard. Very nice. Right. Yeah. Or, no. Hold on. Oh, no. Okay, that's the one that's coming through. There we go. Maybe? Yeah, that works. Alright. Alright. Heading into game number three. That All these works. players just jumping, throwing projectiles at each other. Yep. Fire punches in. Nice. Is that Flare Blitz? Uh, Utah Guinness counterattack in. 
Yeah, Utah teleports out of the corner. Nice counter. Skyner not quite reacting to that properly. Stop rocking the road, and that's not quite gonna connect. Skyner lands in time. Nice hit here. Goes for the counter. Utah not grabbing that, but shields him. Yeah. Nice, nice. Utah there. taking round one. Alright, both players connected with their projectiles. Ooh, nice counter. What was that? I am not sure, but whatever it was, it worked. Oh, Skyner getting the seismic toss. All right, what's the mix up? Just another, another seismic, seismic toss. toss. Skyner with the option select here, and he's going to go in the yeah. burst on this one. Uh, heavy scaling on the burst, of course, yeah. but. But this still will be. Pretty decent damage coming out. Puts yeah. Utah at 68. Half of half of Utah's health done in that. Yeah. So. And Skyner still sitting at a really comfortable life total. And yeah, Skyner takes round number two. Yeah. Skyner's looking very strong with his Charizard. Yeah. I did not realize how much work he's been putting into Charizard. But here's the thing. I honestly feel he hasn't been putting like he doesn't look like he's done much in changing how his play style is. With how he plays Charizard, he's yeah, changed how he's changed his option select. I, I agree. He is choosing a lot safer options. I feel like, yeah, in, especially in field phase. And then when he does get that hit, he's just basically doing the same thing he was doing before. You know, just going uh -huh. for the 50-50s, like he's about to. Let's see what he goes for. Yep. Jumping in, goes for the attack. Oh. Utah only at 70 HP. Skyner is still sitting at 295. That's the Rotom though. That'll makes Charizard a lot slower. Oh yeah, and a slow Charizard is is painful. But I think this yeah, yeah that connects. And Skyner will take game three. Yeah, yeah. Taking two games with his Charizard so far. Skyner sitting one game away from uh, taking the night. Yeah. The shift to Charizard seemed to have yeah, it seems, seems to be, be doing working really well. And and I mean, even if Utah takes another game, takes the set, even he can just switch back to Bird, you know? Yeah. Like Skynerd has room to play with. I mean, you can't count Utah out here. He's doing well. Um, I think just the shift to Charizard threw him off. Yeah, I agree. Like that second game, the first game he Skynerd went Charizard. It was very dominating from Skyner. That last game, game three, was a lot closer. You yeah. know, Skynerd's still able to close it out, though. Uh -huh. Utah taking a minute, taking his uh, little bit of time in between. Um, yeah, just, just thinking. Oh. Yep. Switching up the support. Did he switch to Gunk Sylvia on there? Yeah, Gunk Sylvia. Okay. I, I barely caught it, so I was just confirming that. Yeah, no, he switched to Gunk Sylvia. And we got Magikarp Festival! Ooh. This is my favorite stage, to be honest. I love this stage. Yeah. The music's so hype. Skyner getting in, puts Utah in the corner. And this this is just gonna be Skyner applying pressure, trying to get Utah oh, yeah. to open up, option. which yeah. just opening Utah up and that's all he wanted to do. And he got yeah. so much damage out of it. Yeah, and that's already the round. Jeez. The only damage he took was white health. Yeah. Just some a little bit of white health. 45 damage to white health. That was it. Yeah. And I think it was from a flare blitz too. If I'm if I'm remembering yeah. properly. So I would call that one, that round a perfect. Yeah, I, I can agree with that. But yeah, Utah looking a lot better this round. Yeah, Utah he working on his own perfect. Roll here. Yeah, yeah Skyner. Yeah. Kind of forced to go into burst in that situation. Yeah. He could try playing really patiently there, but. Yeah. He tried yep. to get it. Utah Utah's just popping his burst. Oh, he oh, missed it. No. He's going to get some chip damage from here, but. Yeah. Is that uh, going to do it? That doesn't no! Connect. And just fire punches in. Yep. Better using the Mew. Oh. Barely get caught there. Right into that. 
Yeah, I think Utah just missed his cancel to be able to get that. Yeah, I first. believe so. Oh, what was that interaction? But either way, Utah getting the counter, taking round number two. All right. Now, I want to see Utah with that same round. Yeah. He had the pressure. He had the reads. Yeah, a bit, a bit clumsier towards the end of that round, but the beginning of the round yep. was so strong. Yeah. And, and Utah there going to pick up the, the middle pick up there. Um... Skyder, homing attacking in, has Utah in the corner. Utah slides. Yep, going for barrier, but that gets blown up by the uh, Burton activation. Oh. Ooh, Ooh, gets the seismic toss. Seismic It'll toss. Be in a 50 -50. Um, no, he's just gonna opt, yeah, opt to go it. into it. This is gonna scale <laughs> yeah, a it's... lot. Again, it'll scale, but it gets but some good damage. That's... Look at that. He did probably three fifths of Utah's health there. Yeah, just off of, like, what? A 2-Y. A 2-Y. One of Charizard's... Isn't that a pretty safe option? Yeah. Utah opting to use his burst here. Yeah, not gonna connect. No. Standard Fire Punching in. I'm actually grab. kinda surprised Utah didn't grab off that Fire Punch. Yeah, I agree. Oh! Nice grab. That was, I like that. That was cute. Ooh, oh, barrier. Walking into that. Oh, oh and Utah doing beautiful. it. I, I love that CADC. Oh, way. that was so good. And it baited Skyner to come in. Yeah, it baited Skyner to want to get in, you know, close that distance so he can close out the round. And Utah just threw a projectile at him. Yep. Utah head down in his lap for a moment going, I can't believe I won that round. Yeah. I need a moment to breathe. <laughs> yeah, just taking taking his time, taking a breather, you know. Skynard opting to stay Charizard. Yeah, I mean, he does I, have yeah, he has the this, reset still. Yeah, so. he still has a reset to play with. And, I mean, both his game wins in this set are off the Charizard, so hey, why not? Yeah. All right. Starting off strong. Um, got some fireballs coming out. Yeah. Skyner pushes Utah to the corner, but Utah gets out. Yep. Nice counter. Utah getting the initial phase shift here. Throwing out the barrier to shut down the aerial approach. Yeah, very nice. Some pretty good damage coming out All from right. Utah. Has I think Skyner Utah's kind of gotten his beat. Yeah. Ooh, nice, nice. Ooh, that barrier actually connected. I didn't think it would. Yeah, yeah looking at this, it feels like looking how Utah's now playing. Yeah, it's... He's, not, he's found his tempo. And he's found and is stuffing out Skyner's temple as yeah. well. This is very clean play coming out from Utah. He's taking a couple straight hits, but this is that was just a job. But straight crash. hits are fine. Yeah, straight hits, that's fine. It's as that, long as long as it's not a two wide that you took yeah. as a straight hit and then got seismic tossed out of it. Yeah. Then Utah is chilling. Yeah. Oh, I think he tried to see ADC there and got hit right at with the vulnerable frames on that. Oh, wow. Nice counter. That, that actually worked. Wow. Uh, going for the setup. I don't think he was ready for the wall splat at that moment. Yeah, Skyner using his burst and yeah. using his Mew as well. Ooh, um, nice slide. Yeah. Skyner did get the crits off this one, oh, so. Yeah, this is. Oof. So this is going to hurt a lot. Yeah. Oh, Skyner. Yeah, I, I yeah. agree. Just yeah, use no. your burst. I, I think Skyner should have gone for the burst off that first one. I agree, um, because Utah he, had his own burst up. Like, can make that 50 50 just yep. a safe. And I think he's going to float here. Oh, no. Oh, no. That okay. Doesn't go. Interesting. That, I, huh. I don't know what caused it to not pop the animation there. Um, maybe it's because he was facing the other way. I, I don't know, but either way. But it's Ooh, these that. straight hits here that you. That yeah. type of straight hit you don't want to be taking. Yeah, However, 50 -50. It, it only did. Oh. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. Oh, my Utah reset. That the defense up, though, was. Yeah, that saved him. If he didn't have that defense up, that was. GG. Oh, was, was, he, was he too far for the guard animation? Okay. I mean, it become, it's a projectile the entire time, Callan. Um, Technically. It, it is. Because it's a ball, the entire thing's a projectile. Uh, that's why Weavile can go through it the entire with agility. Skyner going in Polio? Oh, I didn't. I didn't know he played uh, Icebird or Penguin. Uh, he's played it against me before. Um, oh, oh, oh no! He, excuse me. I knew he played Penguin a bit. 
because of the fact that Penguin's one of his favorite Pokemon. Yeah. And he was planning on maining Penguin when Penguin was announced, but then decided to go with Bird instead. Uh-huh. But we'll, we'll see how this works. I, I'm, I'm interested to see, because last time I saw that his Empoleon, it, it didn't look too good. Well, see, the, the other thing I will say is it this, to me, seems like it's going to just be a really hard matchup. Yeah, um, I mean, Napoleon struggles to get in as it is, yeah. and Gardevoir is just going to put up a wall, and yeah, even if he does get in, just read his option, get him out. Ooh, that's still connected. He's gunk, actually. <laughs> I mean, alright. Very good from Utah getting that counter. Yeah. Oh, this guy no. gets a knockdown. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I'm, if Utah wins this, I'm expecting us to see a character shift. Yeah, I, I'm expecting to see Bird if Utah wins this. Yeah. But I, I wouldn't count him out yet. I mean, Bird no huge damage. Yeah, Empoleon, I mean, he is power type, so he does output. No, Empoleon's standard. Oh, is he standard? Yeah, he's standard. Oh. But he might as well be a power type with, because... With the amount of damage he can put out. He puts out insane damage. Shows you how little I know of Empoleon. <laughs> That's how little I see him. <laughs> yeah, he's not a very well, well known character. I mean, he's widely considered to be towards the bottom of the tier list. You know, bottom three is where a lot of people yep. put him. And but I'm loving the setup that Utah's doing here. Yep. Uh, Skyner's doing his best to get in, and he is getting in. However, yeah. Utah's doing a very good job just getting him right back out. Yeah, just stuffing him out, not letting him get anything done once yeah. he gets in. Utah now has to play super safe. Um, oh, one man. Aqua Jet will connect into Burst, so which yeah. he looked for there. Yeah, he, he did look for it. He's oh, looking man. for that connection. He yeah. is looking for it hard. Utah opts for his own Burst, but yeah, Skynerd's just going to be able to shield that. He goes for the Rock Smash, doesn't quite connect. Utah just jumping away. Oh, that'll be it. Oh, no, oh, he does he, Yeah, his burst ran out a little bit ago. I, I didn't notice. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we got the Psychic coming out, and it does connect. Ooh. 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 Jet connects. Not going to get the Rock Smash after, though. And, that, and Barrier, barrier shutting do. it down. Game one um, going to Utah. That was it act, really close. It actually, actually ended up being really close. Um, however, I don't want. I honestly don't want to see him stay on. And pull yeah, no, I I think he's just gonna switch back to Bird, honestly. Yeah. Yeah, and th this is Skyner going back to the character select screen. Yeah, it's either I, go back to Charizard, or go back to Bird, and honestly, I, I think back Bird, Bird. Yeah, because Utah had gotten his gotten the Charizard figured out. Yeah, this is what we'll see. We'll see the Bird coming out. We'll see how he does. Going back to Magikarp Festival. <laughs> <laughs> anyways, anyways, uh, Utah still running the Krogunk Sylvia. Skynerd still running the Mew Celebi. Yep. Very nice, very nice. Teleports in, tries to grab a Skynerd, gonna attack that and get upon it. Skynerd now is trying to get the pressure in at this point, um, but Utah's. Utah's starting to find those gaps in the uh, pressure that Skyner's been doing. And it's starting to counter a lot more in this. Yeah, Utah's doing very well for himself so far. Hasn't taken any super meaningful damage. Ooh, but, ooh, ooh. Oh, it because quite... it was a little too far out, so it sent at an awkward angle and he was unable to... Well, yeah. But like that right there. Yeah. Utah's found that gap in that, in yeah. that combo there. And is able to just CA out of it. Ooh, nice counter pierce. Yep. Skyner popping his burst. Gets the grab. This won't take this so much damage. Utah popping his own burst. And the surprise is here. Skyner. Yep, Skyner just gonna go for that chip damage at this point. Yeah, Utah going for his own chip damage here. Yeah. Uh, does put you. Oh, oh it drops it. The air, the air counter will do it. The regular counter will. Wow. Win. Honestly, I felt like Skyner almost needed to play just a little more defensively at that point. They hit yeah. the 22nd mark. He was in the health lead. Yeah. He just needed to play a little more defensively and punish Utah. Yeah, play reactively. Yeah. 
Q-Top playing a little bit reactively himself. Oh, uh, oh. Skyner getting that getting that uh, grab on the counter. Yep. Uh, sticking storing stance there just to get the mix up on uh, drop in. And it's done well for him because he's taking full control of this round currently. Yeah. Skyner doing super well for himself. Utah can't even use his support right now. Yep. Just came up. But he does have oh. the ability again, but Skyner getting the grab yeah, again. Grabbing. Getting the KO. Yeah. Very Skyner nice. has changed his approach. Yeah, he's changed his approach. Instead of just trying to apply pressure by pressing buttons as one can do with Bird, he's deciding to go for more grabs to counter the play that Utah was having against yep. him, which was counter attack. Stopping his approach a little bit here. Skyner popping his burst. Throwing out the main. Shooting down the Magnemites. The poor Magnemites. They're just there to hold the cameras for us. Yeah. They just want to give us a good view of this match, man. But, yeah, Skyner once again. Just popping his burst. Nice. Jump away. Get the uh, jump. I believe that's his jump action. I believe so. Uh, the, he's yep. his own combo. Uh, this looks like it's scaling quite a bit. Oh, yeah. But... Oh, oh wow, never mind. Never mind. Uh, what is scaling? Ooh, oh, I expected the grab there. Yeah. Utah I'm... was CA was using like five counterattacks there, yeah, so... just kept on CA seeing and Skyner fell for it. Yeah, but Utah... He's sitting on, on match point, tournament point. Yeah, tournament point. What will Skyner do here? Will he stay bird? He's going to stay he's bird. Yeah. Bird. I mean, Utah. He's figured out the Charizard. He's Skyner very well against the Holy. Here, here's the thing. Look at Skyner's face. Yeah, he's, he's upset. Yeah, he's flustered. And this is where either he goes full raging demon or. Or he burns uh, out. Yeah. I've seen him do both in this situation. I have as well. And we'll see what it does here. Oh. Ooh. Ooh I like that. Very well timed. But that, ooh, that scaled a ton. Yeah. I think he didn't want to face shift. Yeah. Most likely. But Utah taking advantage of the fact that they didn't and, face shift, actually. Oh, and taking two fists of Skynard's health there. Yeah. And now Skynard's below half just off of the extra counter attack on top of that. Yeah. Ooh, actually hits the vulnerable frames of the counter attack. Yeah, I think Utah started just a little too early that time. That's the anti air. But Utah has figured out Skynard's approaches. Yeah, and Skynard looking flustered. I feel Skynard's approaching too much in the air at this point. Yeah, he needs to um, take a more grounded approach, try to, you know, get in with those projectiles yeah. he has. Popping I, burst already. I think, honestly, Skyner just needs to slow down. He's yeah. going almost too fast. He's trying to rely on his pressure. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's... That, that hurts. He even gets the counter, Pierce. Gets the counter on the grab. Yep. Yeah, there we go. He's gonna flip around. Yeah. Utah's gonna use his burst now to, to not to just get out of the mix up there. Yeah. Skyner puts him in the corner, goes for the grab, doesn't connect out again. Utah just going for those air counters. Yep. And Skyner he's going for a counter of his own. Now, once now, again, we've seen that not send Oh, him. Skyner. Like, right there. I think he just needed to calm down a little. Yeah. Because Utah was in burst and his burst was draining, he should have let Utah's burst drain out at that moment. Yeah, this could be it. Skyner on one HP. Anything will do it now. All right, he gets the slam in. Yeah, what's, what's the, mix the mix up? up? What's the mix up? The, the grab! grab! And it counters Oh my two. goodness, that's... Oh, that's it? Yeah, All right. and I think I think Kyle actually uh, countered there too. Yeah, I mean, either way, it was a crit because of the Mew. It was a crit, that. plus he had the attack. He got the double buff from Mew. Yeah, so, he had so the that attack was up, a so. done deal. Yeah. Skyner showing signs of life. Alright, what's the mix up? Goes for the counter. Yeah. 
Oh, that actually hit him. All right, using burst to get out of the mix-up that Utah had for him. Yeah, throwing which is him fine. To the corner. Yep. Oh, that magnemite. I was expecting nice. to grab, honestly. I got hit there. <laughs> Going for the burst. Oh, and it does connect. It oh my goodness! Utah pressed a button. Skyner taking a game, showing signs of life here in this second set of grand finals. Yeah. All right, but now he's gonna have to do it all with Bird. He can't switch off his character anymore. No. I think he can do it. I, I think he can. You thought he going back to the character yep. select screen. Skyner looking like he has shifted up how he's approaching. He's that last round, he didn't approach nearly as much from the air there. Yeah, I, which is what he needed to do. Yeah, he he needed to stop the air approach, and it and when he did, and he calmed down a little too. Yeah, he stopped just pushing buttons like what what felt like he was just pushing buttons. Yeah. All right, Utah switching up the support to the Rotom and. Uh, okay, I think he's gonna try to. Sh he wants to try to shut down Skynerd's air approach. Yeah. But he was already doing a fine job at it, but now he just gets a bit of a safer option yeah. to do that. And and with that, he gets to he gets to do it on his terms rather than hoping he shuts it down. Yeah. Nice counter coming out from Utah. Put Skynerd in the corner. Ooh. Interesting. Yep, the future site sitting there putting on pressure. Not sure why he countered there when Skynerd was already countering. Yeah. Oh, unfortunately slides right into the counter. Skyner going for a full combo off of it. Yeah. Gets the wall splat. What's the mix-up? Just throwing projectiles. Yep. That Does good. shut down the counter there. Yeah, and get, goes for the Ooh. reset, but not quite going to get it. Yeah, he, he drifted back down to the ground just a little too much. Yeah. Yep, yeah, Rotom's going to interrupt that. It. But I'd rather get rid of Rotom in that, in that combo than have it... A, Rude one of my approaches. I agree. I agree. Ooh, oh, just waiting for him to press a button and yep. popping the burst. Good stuff from Skyner. Taking round one of game four. Ooh, nice tech on the grab. Yep, and now it gives Utah the chance to take control of this round. Yeah, just dashes in, grabs him again, switches it back to field. And now he's going to start setting up a little bit. Yeah, does connect good. there. Skyner though getting out of that with a jump, ju jumping X. And now we got a very solid combo coming out. Yeah, it took like half his life off that one combo. He goes for the grab, but a nice tech once again coming out from Utah. Once again, using Rotom to try to shut down Skyner's approaches. Yeah, ooh, mistimes the jump X. Yep. And Rotom is gone, so Skynard can ooh. attempt to do that. He, he can but try. Utah's teleporting, calling out the jumps there. Yeah, nice anti air, sets up. Skynard's gonna use this. He definitely wants to try to take the round here. Yeah, that's not gonna connect. Nope. Utah's in the air for this. Yeah, hits him with a laser. Yeah, Utah. Oh no! Oh no. Is that it? Not quite. Oh, just Not barely. Quite. Utah has his burst. Pops yep. it. Now Utah's gonna try to. Oh no. No, he, no he's I don't gonna agree. swing stance here. Oh, oh sucker, sucker punch. punch. Does it? Skyner oh my goodness. Taking game four. Skyner just like that. We're taking. We're wow. Coming. We're gonna get game ten. Oh man. Wow. Are we gonna see Skyner do the reverse 3 0 on Utah after he did the 3 0 on Skyner? Reverse 3 0 on Skynard. We will see. We will see indeed. Nerf Skynard. <laughs> Nerf Skynard. Oh boy. Oh my goodness. Utah sticking with the same supports from last game. Yeah, I don't know if I like the Rotom switch. I don't know. It, He's not getting much off of it. Yeah, it didn't work out too well for him last, last game. Like, he got it once, but it. it wasn't that good of a situation. Yeah. yeah it's kind of getting I, the combo. I feel the I feel the Sylveon would have been better because he could have gotten that defense up, which saved him a number of times. Yeah, I I agree. Skyner kind of just 
has a strong foothold on this game so far. Yeah. Thrown out Rotom. Oh! Ooh. And the Rotom connects too, so yeah. he's gonna get that speed decrease. Oh man. Alright, what's the next up? Okay. Uh. Oh, oh that, that was a beautiful mix up there by yeah, Skynerd. That'll take it. That'll take round Skynerd one. sitting on tournament point. Yeah. In a pretty dominated round, might I add. Yeah. You saw, once again, just taking a moment while the animation's going off, breathing, thinking, analyzing. Analyzing, coming into the what could potentially be the last round of the set. Nice, nice. All right, Utah, throwing out Psychic, uh, Rotom to, so he can keep Skyner grounded. Oh, nice. Oh, oh counter, counter, countering through barrier. Skyner now in, in the ability to take control of this match. Yeah, Skyner gets a pretty decent combo. Not too much oh, damage. Oh, oh, oh what? what? I'm, uh, I'm confused. Uh, uh, okay. The tornado. Not stopping him. Okay, very good. Skynerd was going for the air grab there. Um, yeah. mm -hmm. The first activation, no knock in the back. But Skynerd getting the combo. It goes for the air counter, not gonna connect though. Yeah. I think Utah's getting impatient. He is. Oh, yeah. He's getting way too impatient. Like, he could have grabbed him there. Yeah. He very easily, but uh, the counter will take it. No. Yeah. But he could have. There's a. Like, when he got that dash in, um, he could have grabbed him, shifted the phase, and put Skynerd in the bad position of being behind. But that's, that's going to take it. it. Skynerd gonna be taking Grand Finals. Such a close set. Yeah. Such a close set. Skynerd able to finally, on his, his breathing...